Good morning, this is Arthur Roy Murray from sunny Hollywood, Florida for Books for the Inquisitive Mind. Now, if you're here, you are a reader and you are a leader. And I'm thanking you to come here. Uh, remember to subscribe, pass this on to friends. Uh, the book I'm reviewing today, and I review every Saturday morning, and this is Saturday morning about 4.30 in the morning. I did my book review, written. It's down in the um, description down there. And the book that I'm reviewing today is a golf book. Now, I got my hat on, my golf hat on. I got my Sunday red on. But today's sat Saturday, and I played golf yesterday. I played Tuesday and Friday with uh, two friends. And... I found this little jewel while I was roaming on Amazon looking for something to read, and it's Harley Pennick's Little Red Book. It's of golf. It doesn't say of golf. So a little red book, you think of the Communist Manifesto, but this is not a manifesto on, on, uh, on politics. This is a book on Lessons Learned Over a Lifetime by Javi uh, that he passed on to a number of pros. There's an introduction before, oh, this is before Tiger. <laughs> we, mo most people who don't know a lot about golf only know Tiger Woods' name. Uh, anybody else that's mentioned, maybe Bryson, maybe a couple of others. But this was before Tiger the 60s, 70s, 80s, and 90s. Uh, Davis Love III, Tom Kite, Byron Nelson, and Kathy Whitworth uh, wrote the introductions and introduced you to Harvey at the beginning of the book. It takes maybe, uh, I don't know, about a half an hour to read. Then he gets into, the then the book gets into lessons. And by the way, it was, co-written uh, and uh, edited by Bud Shrek, S-H-R-A-K-E, who is a journalist, or was a journalist, and a uh, sports writer. He wrote a number of novels. While I was doing the search, I'm, I'm probably going to read one of his books soon. I don't know when, but I will. In any case, this is a little jewel I found, and... For golfers that like to read or like to know more about what they got, what they're doing, a lot of people like friends of mine. I brought up the book. Matter of fact, two friends bought the book after me, uh, and one he had no idea what a waggle was, what it was used for. What it's used for is to get the tension out of your body so you can smoothly hit the ball. He didn't know, and now. I played with him yesterday, and the ball, he's killing the ball. Before he would, was hitting a ball, every once in a while he was clobbering it. Now, every time he is. That's my little tidbit. Javi uh, goes into some funny things. Uh, Tommy Aaron, which you probably don't know, <laughs> uh, was asked by a golfer, how do you make that ball spin back after it hits the green? And the, the, uh, ask the average golfer, well, wait a minute. Um, what do you play? You play once a week, uh, once every other week, whatever. Uh, do you always hit past the, the flag? No, no, I'm always short. I said, then why do you need a spin back? <laughs> That's funny. Another thing that uh, my lady friend who played golf with us yesterday uh, asked the question, uh, and and read it in there. The question was, do you let your husband help you play golf? The answer, Javi, is no, you don't, because they play a different kind type of game. You ask a woman pro how to figure out what you're doing with your game. Uh, I, I say this all the time, but I really love this book. Uh, I only gave it four stars because it, it got too much into biography of people. Uh, 
However, it's got all tidbits, swing, how to, uh, coming out of the sand trap, you name it. You got a problem with it, Javi, Javi Pennick took care of it. And I want to thank you for being here. Remember, hit the bell, subscribe. See you later, alligator. This is author Roy Murray. The next book I got is a doozy. I'm reading it now. It's called Hook by Mr. Moss on how we are addicted to processed foods, sugar, salt, and fat. See you later, alligator. Bye-bye.